When the artist first showed me his work, I didn't know what to make of it. I had to ask what it was all about. He simply said it was about dreams, but he will leave it to his viewers to interpret it. Usually, it is easy for me to spot a story or see meaning in an artwork, but this one took me days as I didn't know where to start. An artwork usually has a focal point to lead your eye on where to start. The guy with his head down could probably be it, if only because he's in the center. But as I studied the painting further, I feel that this is the starting point because it's the only one looking like he's looking back. Everything else in the painting shows a montage of his past that make up who and where he is right now. Although the plane might easily suggest travel, but without a context, it's hard to tell if it's a trip that was disrupted in 2020, or is it his most memorable trip, or does it represent his longing to fly again? The fish in the blue wave suggests that he is a man of the water. Perhaps he likes to swim with the fishes, scuba dive, fish, or all three. He is the little boy with the sad eyes, and those are his parents. But I don't think he's in the room, as the mother's naked. It's a scene he has created in the mind why his parents are not married. They're inside a cheap hotel where his father walks out upon learning that she's pregnant. The vintage TV set dates this scene as to when this happened. His father cannot marry her because he already has a family of his own. His father is holding a bag with an inverted clock which suggests that he has been out of their lives for a long time, if not the entire time. The dark shadow next to his father's profile indicates he is a man our boy never knew. Our boy is kneeling beside a standing aquarium. Perhaps growing up, he found solace in fish. The bird will soon be replaced by the plane to suggest freedom from his unhappy home. He is now grown up living in the city as indicated by the building where the cat sits atop. It is resting beside our guy who is always surrounded by animals, which include a horse symbolizing strength, which our guy seems to need with the way he's holding his head down. But the strength that he needs is neither physical nor emotional, but moral. During one of his regular walks at night, he stumbles on a nefarious plot by people wrapped by a serpent. This leads us back to where we started, him contemplating on what to do with his discovery. We can't tell him as we don't have any more clues except for the hope of freedom as symbolized by the bird should he make the right decision. The artist Medardo Alarco calls his work repetition in allusion to how life tends to be on replay loop mode. It's a vicious cycle from which there is no escape until and unless we make that one right decision to break it and lead us to freedom from our painful past. Knowing how to make right decisions is essential. Art is essential. Mm -hmm.